This is the leaderboard. Zelinski, as we said, remains undefeated. This morning, he's feeling a lot better with his hand. Well, if that break is any sign, uh, he can see it. A few months for these guys. They're playing with carbon fiber. I feel that a lot of the carbon fiber shafts are more of the same. There might be some different subtleties in power for some guys. We've mentioned Shaw very strong mentally. All he has to do is put his mind to it. Yeah, one thing Shaw does have compared to a lot of the others, he has a very close. And Coping Yi. Two balls away from defeating Gorst when Gorst carried Defeated. the lead. Gorst will live to fight another day. Shaw making quick work. And that's what the good Shaw does. He is unstoppable. Hanoi showed all of us that, Carl. You have a little reality series with him. Well... I've noticed that Shane's taking a little speed off the break, and he's getting a shot on the two. The one, but the spread wasn't real good. Well, this spread is real good. Easy work for SVP. Pretty hard. That's what he's done. Manipulating the cue Indeed ball works. up. And that's gotten away from just a fraction. He's in better luck. He's almost perfect. Couple of break and runs. To start this match out. Oh, and Shaw's got kissed in the corner. He let up on that break, hit him pretty soft. Also, I just think it's better to run the balls, isn't it? Just get a I mean, most few professional pops. players will avoid the combination just to run the balls, especially when the percentages are there. Bam boning. He's got a lot of miles under his belt, and a lot of titles. Here comes the cue ball, pin point. Rapid City, Active. South Dakota, spends most of his time there. Likes to fish. Talked him into getting a boat, Carl, about nine years ago. Game number three. He is indeed. It's all business here for the five-time U.S. Open champ. Shaw sure knows how to beat Shane. He's and there's the nice break again. He's going to come away with another shot and a fine one at that. The pink four. So he was straight. Although the way he potted it, it looked like he could have come off the ring. Oh, he's gone into the six. How is this going to finish? I believe the nine has him. Well, I thought he would chip it down underneath the seven and maybe come under the six. Three years oh, well. old, born in 1980. He's still a puppy, Carl. From Glasgow, United Kingdom, right. won yeah. in 2010. He, he won that actually a long time ago. He was 2010. Very young. Yeah, 13 years ago. Teen now, actually. Here comes the cue ball. To me, it looks like a different player this today. Is his own pool room. He knows a lot of people in here. You can tell when he wins a rat apart in this league it. here this week. Of course he doesn't. Yeah, you see, it's just louder when Shaw wins a wreck. He's got the one down. A 
pretty clever. Wow. Wow, Still what a hit. To the full. SVB kicking at the two. Good hit. Where's it going to end up? Does this ball go down the rail past the nine? A little. Yes, yeah, see. Oh, he's played that beautifully. The speed was all too important. Well, he's elected to come to the short side. Oh, he was able to put outside English on it. Carl Boy's pointing out the captain, Jeremy. Oh, yeah, there's a bit of a theme I've noticed here between the commentators. Frosty was hitting balls yesterday. JJ Dang. today. There's only Shaw making quick work. safety in this rack that has helped Shaw win another and you can just hear the difference made a ball oh look at this Carl yeah good job the one way frustrated he got the kiss on the cue ball but then the one dropped I think with this break Carl you just kind of come up got every kiss on the table perfectionist he is might drive him a little this match is turning out to be everything we thought it would SV that's the beauty of this format Keeps the pressure on these guys, doesn't it, this format? And it's a lot different from previous years, purely because we've let VIP fans come. You can just see them all crowding around the table. Looked a little flat, that one. Metal. Yeah, and that was a... Oh, he's hit it. Well, he doesn't want to catch the point. He's actually done not not bad there, has he? To get yeah, he looks like a different player to me today. Back to that safety that SVB played on the one. I did mention he's got to hit it thin, and he did have to hit it thinner than that. He was flirting with the side. Than everybody else, so. He's also battling that as well. I say battling it. That's what's it's making him. It's off the crowd, him. doesn't he? Always has. His performance at the Moscone. You know, he this year was two ball with a tough out, and raising his hands and pumping the crowd up. And just, I've never seen anything like it. He just played perfect. You could see his bridge on there. It looked so close to the cue ball. Packed versus most players. Needs another one. He's missed the one ball. Well, he's hit those hard again. Much, much harder than he's hit the others. Back down. you got to feel. Well, not only that, Carl, but going back to his break. Look at the spread, right? You see the way these balls are. The, the three, four, nine. The, the three to the four. Watch outside pocket. What's he done here? Oh, oh the cue balls wow. dove down. And it really didn't waver at all. It was going where it ended up hitting. Looks like he's yeah, entertained. This could be a fun shot to watch. Look at this hit. Has he overhit this ball? This is unbelievable. You could never dream in life. So is there one last hope for SVB? Oh, and he's hit this well if he misses the point. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Did he get Which oh. tells us he can pop this ball. Oh, wow. Look at this cue ball. So he had to spin that ball clearly. This He's not going to miss it. 
but it's missable. It's 4-4, four, four, Scott. It is 4-4. Four, four. Shaw had a chance. Scott talked us through that shot to see who gets the point. Shaw's got the one ball. No pot on the two. The it seems like it. I always think, well, it's nice when both players get to get out of the chair and have a shot or two. Good shot, good safety. And he's lost the cue ball. How is it going to finish? Wow. Where the shot clock referee is sat, this ball needs to travel, just missed the nine, which it does. Yeah, both, both tables have a little digital clock. Well, I believe he was trying to kick behind the ball. I think Here. he was trying to kick. Oh, what a great hit this was. Man, what a clever shot. Oh, it's taken off that third rail. Well, you've got to wonder. If he played to like the made ball out, but he knew the cue ball was coming down here. Shaw framming, just hoping something good Anything happens, and it has. You need a bit of luck. So was he trying to go into the eight there, or is this what he played? Oh, and he's played this down low, but it's going to finish poorly. Even if he is snookered, SVB definitely jumping it. Is he hooked? Wow, I do not know what English he put on that one being that flat. Three, so this would keep him on one win out of four. And then all the players are creeping away. Seven in the left to... middle. That's what he's done. Pretty good control there. He had to punch under after four losses against him as well so overall pretty good match I don't think either guy played poorly SVB gets the job done what a match we was treated to there SVB